Where did you learn your work ethic? A couple of different places. Um, my parents have just been tenacious you know, workers. And, and it goes back even further, I think, to my grandfather, right? So he's able to find a way to get his family out of Albania, you know, get into Montenegro, get to the Bronx, and come here with nothing. Um, basically, find opportunity here through relationships and contacts and have eight children in the Bronx. And, you know, fast forward to today where my dad went to Columbia, has a PhD, is still working for the government. My uncle is, you know, owns and operates the Russian Tea Room. I work for him and now I'm running for city council. In 1968 when he came here, I don't know if he actually realized that was possible. Um, I like to think he did because he knew that this was the one country where anything, you know, could happen and the opportunities were there. So my grandfather was always a, a source of inspiration, I think, just growing up because he lived across the street from me where we can, you know, we saw him every day. He was up there first thing in the morning, whether it was in his garden or just out there kind of, you know, pushing us around and telling us we need to get up and get to work and study hard and work hard. And, you know, he always believed in, in service as well. So, you know, between him and, you know, my mom who has her own small business and, you know, my mom never graduated high school and started her own custom embroidery business in Northern Virginia. And it's been fantastic. You know, she's a constant source of inspiration. I'm a big uh, mama's boy. So, you know, she's, uh, she's been great. And my dad with his work too. So, and my, my uncle, who I work for now, I mean, I've learned so much, of, I think, about public service and kind of diplomacy and, and government for my father. And then when I came to work for my uncle, he is, you know, just one of the hardest working people I've ever met. And everything he's done in just real estate and, you know, helping to, you know, buy the tea room, save it and so on has just been, you know, I've been very blessed to have such amazing kind of role models and uh, mentors around me. So 